What's up guys, Jellowood here and I'm back again with another video and this time we have the landlord Sao Kodier talking about bragging again. Well, um, I haven't been reacting for a very long time. I was also working on myself. I got a, I got something out, okay? I got something new out. I'm going to put it in the description. Yeah, so, yeah. Anyways, we have Sao Kodier brag. Without further ado, let's get into it. Sako there to where you rich no beefs. We know you already. We know you which which another brag again. What other brag? We already know you, boy. We already know your achievements. Say I come to brag on us again. Yeah, came in again when I was supposed to. Come in and I'ma had nobody to go to. Poor boy from the god, I wanna get nothing to eat, but I was thinking about selling the O2. I never The O2 he's talking about is not the O2 indigo that medical sold out to. It's not that one. I be that one. He has done it before. He has sold out the O2 Indigo before. He's talking about the arena itself. The O2 arena. Yes. So he's saying he came in the game when he was supposed to. It's not by chance. He knew what he was doing. So he came in the game when he was supposed to. He didn't have anything, but he was thinking of selling out the O2. I gave up on the dream, but I was close to you. Even the people with it for coach you. Started switching up on me and I was losing the government. And it was up like everybody they pushed you. This, this part is really hard. Like. As an artist, right, it's almost like a lonely road because there's no guarantee that you make it. You may have the talent, but there's no guarantee that you make it. That's why a lot of people don't really, like, how do I say it? They don't go into the creative space like that. Even the people with it for coach you. Started switching up on me and I was losing it. Got famous and it was up. I got everybody they coached you. So he said he never gave up on his dream, but he was close to. And I, I get that. I'm, I get I, I relate, I can relate, okay, so he said even the people that are supposed to coach you, people that are already there, like let's say your role models or something like that, people that are already there that you are in touch with, that are supposed to coach you, started switching up on him, they started switching up on him, even if he sends whatsapp crowd, them the ghost town, I've been there too, like that's why they kind of say never meet your role models, you, you get dis uh, disappointed. Some of them, you text them, you'd be like, oh, how did you get here? He will tell you consistency. That's all they will tell you, consistency. <clears throat> how do? A boy from the ground, I wouldn't get nothing to eat, but I was thinking about selling the O2. I never gave up on the dream, but I was close to you. Even the people with it for coach you. Started switching up on me and I was losing it. Got famous and it was up like everybody they coached you. I had a feeling I was gonna be bigger than how the people see me. Put my money where my mouth is. Tell my brother, my man, my man, me send me cash. I'm not supposed to be sleeping on this couch. I was born to make it out of the ghetto with a couple of my So hold on, hold on. Let me take it back. Let me take it back. Now pay attention. Gonna be bigger than how the people see me. Put my money where my mouth is. He had a feeling he was going to be bigger than what people see him to be. So he has to put his mouth, uh, his money where his mouth is. You don't just talk, right? You don't just talk. You have to back up your words. That's why, that's, I think that's the meaning of put, uh, put my money where my mouth is. And then another, another thing too. Listen to what he's about to say. If I look in my life, my mother gave birth to me to come and chop money. To come and chop money. Also put my money where my mouth is. My mother gave birth to me to come and chop money. You. On this couch, yes. I was I'm not supposed to be sleeping on these couches. I don't, I, don't, I don't know how that relates. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not sure how that relates. But let's go. On this couch, yes. I was born to make it out of the ghetto. A couple of mama the rolling and buy myself a couple of houses. I was born to make it out of the I was born to make it out of the ghetto. Cut my mama a rolling and then cut myself a couple of houses. Okay. Bitch, I'm trying to touch a meal, put your pussy on the side Give me space, make it look touch my trousers Which kid them, I was already doing it David Joe started with Mill, space No relation Okay, he's, he's just rapping at this point He's not dropping any really hard bars Since he says brag that's literally what he's doing. Yo, a couple of mama the rolling and buy myself a couple houses. Uh. Bitch, I'm trying to touch a mill. Put your pussy on the side. Give me space. Make it look touch my trousers. We are, trying, we are trying to touch a million. A million, bro. Like, just put that shit aside, nigga. Don't even open it. I don't want to see it. Don't even touch my trousers. We are working here. Was I was already doing it. David Joe started when I was improving it. And then Odogu came through. Black Sheriff to watch. I can't still go with you. Thought I was losing it. My so, this, this line... It simply means like longevity. 
He's been in the game for a very long time. You understand? Whiskey came, the video came. Now a uh, black sheriff, a uh, burner boy. Is he saying he was there before these guys? It, it could mean the same thing that he was there before these guys. But he, the main point is he's still going at it. He's still rapping because there are a lot of people Sakori also started with, but you don't hear of them anymore, right? You don't. That's the main points of this line. Just when I was losing it, my biggest competition is Kendrick and Cole. Tonight I'm touching the club, spending some dough. Kendrick and Yang. My biggest competition is Kendrick and Cole. Come on, Sak. Come on, Sak. Okay, fine. You are bragging. Let's go. Tonight I'm touching the club, spending some dough. I sit the microphone and I'm ready to go. The ball wraps in and it's all keep it tall. Me tippy time in that truth. I pass the test. So, me tip beat me in your truth. When I see beat, I want to hop on it. I want to eat. I want to feast, you bar like he they eat rap, so he wants to feast. Too flight. I swear the shit is too light. I gotta break, I'm too quiet. I'm a bomb a bread, I'm so tight. Snipe these rappers on sight. Fuck with me, I'm gonna strike. Okay, so about um what I said out I put out. So here's here's a preview. Wanna be a rapper, rap for the thrill. This shit is business, where's my deal? Look at me behind bars, niggas spitting and dropping the bars. Nearly escape out of jail, never a regular joke. So I gotta be lyrical, pouring my heart on the track. Let's skip a beat, feeling so vulnerable, we could go surgical. Rapping for long, trying to tell him my story, but my story untold. Speaking to life, but still a nigga unknown. The way that I move by myself, going in solitude, everything planned by cycle. In order to fight to me, be the one, all experience is vital. If I'm the one, then I'm placing your second or third. I ain't playing COD, but I'm used to the cord. Who won't smoke, come forth. Girl, my scope, so I'm taking my shot. These rappers are pleading the fit because they ain't got no answer. Yeah, so link in the description. Please support your boy. Please. Put it in the web, we don't hide. When it comes to this, I'm too nice. So with this line, there are a lot of people that have thrown shots at Sarkodie and he has responded to only a few of them. So what he's saying is, when you diss him, he knows that you guys are waiting for a response because you want attention, you want um, clicks, you want views, because Sarkodie is kind of like the biggest artist. Arguably, Sarkodie is arguably the biggest artist in Ghana. Ibab. So he knows that when you throw shots at him, you are waiting for a response. But he's not going to give you that attention on that response because you already know that the industry it's a game, it's a joke. You bar. But then they go to wait for response, but I do that they get that should be joke. I swear to God, Ghana had nobody had a nerve. It was me, myself, and now where I carry all the load. You got to check yourself when you talk to me. Told the BL was at the kind, was that you messing with the goat. And also, if I'm up there, I wouldn't like to be referred to as a goat. Like, GOT, I know it's an acronym, greatest of all time, but still, I mean, have you seen goats? Nah, please do not, do not refer to me as a, a goat, okay? If I'm out there, just, just call me boss, right? That's all. I don't want any goats. Mm -mm. <laughs> it's not fun. through it all, so the nigga don't stop. Hope y'all taking notes. Like Drake, I've been walking through the six with my. I told you corny niggas to decay the cold So I charge in the battery and I'm ready to go Started with a couple of niggas but them will be cold Few people rap So it started with a couple of niggas but them will be cold like Yeah they, <laughs> their career is You bad When you start you are hot You are you're hungry But when you reach a certain level the temperature just keeps dropping But now it's cooled we we never the phone. Anytime I hop on beat, I start compete. Cause the nigga come from street and I don't sleep. I gotta get back on feet. I don't cheat. Make I want the start complete. Got some heat. So many reasons I don't speak. Cause a lot of these rappers still stuck on beef. Let's be honest. So many reasons why I don't speak. Cause a lot of these niggas still stuck on beef. Are you saying they are still waiting for the response? I don't know. How many rappers can rap on this type beats? Top it on if they're not going to freeze. Huh? Please, how do I get these beats? How do I get these beats? Let me take this challenge. How do I get these beats? Let me rap on this. Like, I feel like this is my type of shit. Like, my type of beat. 
Oh, hell you don't even know me. Chill, chill. Chill, chill. Chill, chill. Okay. Yeah, so um, that's the end of the video. Please hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. And if you stuck with me to the end, I tip my hat to you. My imaginary hat. Yes, I tip my hat to you. Yeah, so yeah. Please like the video. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. Very important. So that you'll be notified anytime I drop a video. Feel free to comment in the comment section if you have any requests for me. Request it and I'll make sure to shoot a reaction video to it. We're done here, right? <laughs> Jello!